Hey boys and girls, back again for another uh, recording. Let's uh, hold the D and boot up into 50 Hz this time. Going to boot up Attic Attack. Uh, yes, enter this mode. 50 Hz is the most compatible, they say. I haven't tested Attic Attack yet on this system, so keep it in 50. Let's see what happens. E. I hope I did, I did set it up uh, correctly on the SD card. Let's see. There it is. A top file. This is probably long loading times. No, that's alright. That was cool. It was actually fast. Did I boot it up maybe one time because I didn't have to select the mode? Hmm. I thought this was the first time I booted it up. Okay. Ah. Wi-Fi. Keyboard night, yes. Uh, no. Camston, yes. I think I noticed that if you have the Camston, you often don't have to reconfigure the NMI joystick stuff to Camston. Apparently the Mega Drive configuration is good for that. So let's start game as a knight. Now, first time I played this version, not entirely true. Um, I played this for a tiny bit. Okay, how do we pick up shit? That was pause. I played this on G uh, Rare Replay. Okay, we have to figure out how to pick up shit, guys. Uh, Z. Z for pickup. Okay. My goal today is to uh, complete the game. Uh, as a knight, I guess. I'm the most familiar with the knight. Um, uh, the Rare Replay gameplay that I got in was not focused, it was just. Get the achievement on the Xbox and uh, be done with it. And I didn't like the game, to be honest. Um, I started really playing this game when uh, the, the the next version was here. On the when my next came in, uh, I could download the next version. The, the Attack Attack Next, which has cool music, uh, updated graphics and stuff. Uh, what what am I waiting for? <laughs> Let's go here. Updated graphics, uh, 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 music, and, and then I sort of fell in love with it. And that one is, I think, I am already doing a good job of navigating, I think. It's uh, close to this original map. Even more close than the Commodore 64 version that came earlier than the next version. That's the Commodore 64 version. I, I learned now, I played it uh, recently on the channel, then I didn't know, there's uh, an extra room that you need a uh, claw thing for. Uh, so that is already different, and I felt like some enemies were in different positions and blah blah blah. So it was uh, a different, a small different experience to the original, whereas the next at least follows the same map. Picking up a lot of food without even considering my food. Uh, good job, Jeffrey. Now I don't have the uh, the right key yet to get behind Mr. Uh, what's his name? Hunchback? All fine. We'll come back here later, I suppose. Uh, I'm probably not going to do a good score because I'm blabbing, not paying attention too much. It's like a quick uh, in-between lunch break uh, session that I'm doing here. No red key. Let's see if uh, one of the doors opens up. Like that one or that one. Come. Well, I have to say, the devil's quite forgiving. He seems faster in, uh, in, uh, in other versions. They're knowing the map already from playing the other games. Uh, that's the benefit I have. Of now playing the original, the, the, the classic original that everyone loved on the ZX Spectrum back in the day. Which I never got to play as a kid. I didn't even know of its existence uh, up until the Rare Replay, rare replay uh, version came along. And there, I think, there's like a challenge that you do for your achievement. And the game is set up in, in ways already. 
uh, with everything uh, like the keys are in a fixed position for that game. So you kind of map out uh, the bits and pieces that you need to navigate to complete the challenge and he's always in the same position and blah blah blah, it's just too easy. I didn't finish exploring the left side, shit, I need to go back. Oh no, let's check this out now, the door is open. This door is open, oh but that is with the clock, we'll go there next I suppose. Expect him next, huh? I'm uh, I'm off. I feel off today for some reason. Don't know why. I streamed yesterday on the on, on my uh, my gaming channel with the Big Boy Games. Uh, let's just check this. This leads to a, 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 a dead end. I know, but we don't have the key. Yes. Birds and food is nice. Um, I had a good stream. Didn't drink too much because I was watering down my vodka the whole time. <laughs> That's the way to do it. Uh, also had a long rest. Yeah, didn't go to bed too late. Actually, was able to sleep in a little longer this morning. I don't know why I feel off today. Weird. Also, the wife is at home today, but she took the kid just now, uh, so they, they're, they're outside. Uh, she's going to do some shopping and then pick up uh, the daughter from school. And that was my moment to uh, have my lunch break, my extended lunch break. And I'm not streaming because well, I'll stream tomorrow probably. That was the, the original intent. Wait a second, shouldn't there be more rooms? No, I know now. You go around him. I could kill. I could have killed him with the with the wrench. It's in the in the room to the left. I think these rooms we didn't discover yet. And there he is, the blue key. I love it. Z. I'm bound to find some food here. Uh, let's explore this for completion. See, food. Hey! That's uh, good to know. Now oh, we're here again. Uh, and. Going this way. Going to use the keys now to open as much doors as possible. And then at least get rid of the gold key. That is my strategy usually. Hey, red key. Might want to. Uh Think about dropping a key and get the red key with me. But which key to drop? That's the question. I think there's a green door up here. Let's let's do that bit. I, I guess maybe as uh, we're, we're close to getting uh, at the point where the green key doesn't make sense to hold on us anymore. I suppose. I don't know if the red key is quite important up here. Maybe it isn't. Um, it actually is for... Top left door? Or is that blue? Just do the attic bit. Be done with that. I think we have all the stuff we need to do a full run around this, uh, this area. Uh, okay. Keep in mind that I opened the blue door. I normally don't do that as a, <laughs> as a point of interest that I want to drop down there. Uh, 
I usually navigate along the sides of the of the attic. That is is that the key bit? I think so. So now I have done my job with the gold key and get rid of that. Like that, that and that. God damn it. Love it. There is actually one door still on the second floor I should have opened first. God damn it. Uh. Um. The completion should check there. Oh, that's red door territory, never mind. Making a mess of this, guys. I, I can do better. <laughs> yeah. Like I said. Not 100% there today. And, uh, who cares? We're just doing a quick run and I'll see where I end up on the scoreboards on level, uh, level of score.com. And uh, probably do a run when I feel better. A one of those silent runs with the, with the maps. Can't we go behind here? What is this? This is new. I don't want to drop down here. I want to get to the... To the door there. This is not something I experienced in the other versions. This is new. So now waiting for the trap door to close. There. On level of Scarlet we don't compete for score in this game. I think we completed everything, okay. I always forget where I end up. Oh, at Risky. Uh, we'll come back for you. Because I think I'm now done with the, with the green one. We hoard, we hoard our stuff in front of the door. There we go, door. That bit goes here. Uh, green key, yeah. Now pick up the red key. And what shall we do next? I saw a piece in the caverns, right? So maybe we should go there. Oh, I made him angry. Oh my funky gut. Why do I keep messing these things up? Goodbye, health. <laughs> well, lucky there's some here. Um, caverns, caverns, caverns. This leads to the caverns, right? Some, some food pickups. That's why I was going here. Now where did I see it? Uh, was it over here this side? I think so. Are you here, Key? Where are you? Going to be somewhere here, yes. Good job, Jeffrey. You're so good at this game. Now it's probably faster to go out through the, the demon area there, but uh, uh, I think this is safer and we'll pass some food. And I just know know my way around here. <laughs> Safer. Huh. Ah, so they make a mess out of things. Hmm? Back to the mummy room. Hello. There you go. No, wrong key. Love it. Uh, let's move. Move up here. And check. Top left. Hey. Green door. Oh man, if I need to do. Uh, bottom left corner in this, this map. Um, that might be a challenge. I'll have to see. This, uh, on this floor. 
that's where I need a gold key for and maybe also the green key I just noticed. And I, and I passed this earlier, so I'm just stupid. Hopefully the, the bits and pieces are here. That we need. That would be good. Now this key, green door is okay. I can uh, move around it. I really hope the key, uh, the final bit is here. The, 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 the master key, the AGM whatever key. Let's see. Pray. No, of course not. That's my luck. That's my luck. So we have two options now. The, 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 the getting the gold key again is going to be a bitch, I think. Will take me long. Um, do I have blue key on me and not? I dropped the red key. This is a waste of time, yeah, in my run. God damn it. I need the red key to get behind Hunchback. And that was, I think, the first thing I'm going to do. I think Hunchback has the key. Where did I drop it? I lost my red key, guys! <laughs> Boo! Yeah. I know what I did, I didn't drop off the G, so... Oh my god! Uh, let's drop your shit off. It was actually not that bad to dropping down, I suppose, but yeah. I never know where I am. <laughs> Up until I see like uh, oh, upstairs, yeah, okay, uh, there I am. Jesus, what a mess up. Yeah, could bring the green key for now, for fancies. Uh, what a mess. Hunchback. Um, over here. Uh, but to get behind the hunchback, we need to go to this uh, top right side. Here we go. And only the knight can do this, guys. So to this clock, now I'm behind the hunchback. And no key. No part of the key. Uh, we can still also look for this bit here. And then didn't explore this room. This is also one. Yes! Yes! I love it. Uh, let's go home. Go around to the yellow door. Well, then I, I do think this is a good time still for the level score that comes. A decent time. Although I made a mess of things. Uh. I don't know if this is one of those that you need to assemble the key in the right direction. I need to do that on the C64. I'm assuming that's a, a thing they bought from the original, so... Here you go. 85% in almost 70 minutes. But 60 minutes gives me a, an advantage on the level of score that comes, because the leaderboard is... Uh, one of them is like... Uh, subtract your uh, total rooms explored minus... Uh, uh, subtract the minutes from that, the full minutes. Level of score that comes... Where are you? Passes completion. On emulation, 23 minutes, yes! What parts did I miss? I kept keep going having these 75% uh, runs on Commodore 64 as well. I'm missing a, a part of the caverns and uh, I missed the doors in the caverns, that's for sure. Um, I'm happy with this. I'm happy with this. Uh, this is not the preferred version I will play, I, th I guess. I think if you grew up with this game, this is an excellent game to revisit, but I am not that much of a uh, ZX Spectrum Classics uh, enthusiast, because of... That's not where the nostalgia is for me, I suppose. Yeah, it's, it's good stuff, I, I'm happy to explore it, don't get me wrong. But hey, thank you for so... Yeah. Thank you for watching, thank you for subscribing, and see you in the next one. Cheers!